What's good, YouTube? It is your boy Chris, and I'm back at again with another banger video. And y'all, you already know who I'm with. I am with my beautiful granny. And y'all, if you haven't already, go watch the last reaction. I had her react to Lonely Child, and it, we we had we had a really good we had a good conversation. Yeah. I would say that. So y'all check it out. Y'all can see her thoughts on the whole entire song. Don't forget to leave a like, comment if you're new to this channel. Go hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to follow me on all my social medias. And yeah, I'm doing way too much talking. You ready, Granny? Always ready. Uh, so this right here, Granny, we are reacting to Heart and Soul. Uh, this is also another song too. It's called Alligator Walk, but I'm not about to have you react to it. If y'all want her to react to it, let me know down in the comment section. We're only reacting to Heart and Soul. Uh, he made the song whenever he got out of jail. Okay. Something like that. So, so you're about to basically see his mindset and, you know, how much he grew whenever whenever he got so out of jail. So he's coming out of jail. Yes. Okay. And oh yeah, cause uh cause on here, uh he's on house arrest. And also I do want to tell you, uh, he did beat his first case. He has one more case. Okay. He, he has another case, but he, he he did he beat he beat the other case and he made that he made the FBI and all, he made them look goofy. Okay. Yeah, so he beat that one, he one more case and then he's and he's talking about going on tour and stuff like that. Okay. So yeah. It's about choices. You have to choose the right road. There's two roads you can follow. You can follow life, and you can follow a destructive road. In in one line, he did say he said he said he was trying he was trying to blame his friends. Yeah, but he can all, only blame himself. Only blame himself. Yeah, and that's another thing. And what's missing is love. Mm -hmm. You know, when you don't have or when you don't grow up with love. Okay, uh, you can continue saying what you were saying. And um, that's one thing that I, I see with our young men is the, not the lack of love. And a lot of times young men are told, well, you you know, you're the man of the house. And this kid might be eight, nine years old. And to tell you that, for someone to tell him that, he feels like all the responsibility falls on him. But from listening to this young man that before and happened, I, I really feel that if his grandmother had, was still alive, mm -hmm. he would be a lot different, you know, but you can, you can feel the hurt and the pain that he's bearing in his music, and he's still trying to figure things out. How old is he? Uh, I think he's, uh, I want to say he's 20... Three, twenty-three. I think I don't okay. even know. I don't. I don't know. Yeah. I'll. I'll tell you his age. Uh, whenever the video ends. But yeah. So let's continue. Okay. Oh, and also, no, nah, actually, let's just continue. <laughs> So my girl don't wanna bust down. I ain't even been worried about the jury now. I've been wanting to do right since I touched down. I've been watching the way I influence now. I ain't post out a picture I moved on. I'm responsible to all these children now. Even though that they label me tough now. Back into my normal home. Back inside my closet, putting that Velo on. Okay, so Velo, that's that's a clothing brand. Mm -hmm. But uh, he said a lot right there. He said a he lot. He don't care about the jury. 
He busts down. He busts down his girl. He's not trying to go down the window, bust at people no more. Yeah. yeah. Uh, he's you know he's at a lot. Well, What's some stuff that stood out to you? For one thing, by him being in home incarceration, it's given him time to think. Mm -hmm. It's given him time to reflect on his life. And now he's seeing, and plus with age, he's seeing now that he made a lot of mistakes. You know, and he's like, to me, how did I get caught up in this? But he knows that from his childhood, that's some of the reason why. But even you still have to, it's still about choices. Life is about choices. But I, cause I feel his pain in his music, you know, but then he's making some corrections now. And as you get older, you start looking at things more differently from what you're looking at now. Mm -hmm. And see, TV has a lot, they portray a lot of images and movies, a lot of images, and we can't get caught up in the images. We have to each, everyone has to have a soul search of themselves. And they have to realize, what do I want out of life? And by him spending this time at, alone at home by himself, can't go anywhere, it causes you to think. And this is what is happening now. And you're probably going to see as he, be, as he begins to get older, a change in his music. Mm -hmm. Right now, he's burning out his soul. He's telling what's going on in the inside of him, which is really good because everybody has to do soul searching mm -hmm. to make changes. Go to board, I had to listen while sitting on the phone. First time got her in my arms, like I can't leave you alone. Well, I only thought sometimes I don't. I got feeling in my soul. I ain't people when all these niggas don't even mention me. They gon' kill me if they can't. No need for this and come get rid of me. I'm grown now, I'm a man, so tell them ain't no time for sympathy. I now, Granny, I can tell you one thing. Young boy does always say he's not scared to die. And you do, you always do have a lot of people that always be like, I'm not scared to die, mm -hmm. blah, 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 blah. Well, young boy, he is one person I, I will, I can honestly say, I do believe him and I will say he's not scared to die. He, if, if his well, time comes, his time comes. We all, all our time is limited. <laughs> but to hear somebody so young to say that, you know, we all have limited time. And one thing we, we have to watch is self-destructive behavior, you know, because, uh, you know, a lot of the young men are getting caught up into the drugs and you have to watch what you do. And you even have to watch the people you are around. Mm. Is everybody around you for you? Yeah. And that's real. That's another struggle with young men. Sometimes young men get caught up into things before they ever even thought about it. And that's what, you know, you can't free the mind, but he's doing a lot of thinking, a lot of thinking now. And and he's talking about getting caught up. Hey, if y'all haven't already, go watch my story time on my, on my personal channel. I got caught up and, hey, that's all I'm about to say. Just go watch my story time because that, hey, that was a crazy, crazy experience, wouldn't you say? But, it, but also experiences make you. Yes. You learn from experience. If you're gonna keep repeating the same thing over and over, then you've never learned anything, you know, because you keep doing it. Each experience is experience. You should learn something from it and you should move forward. Don't keep going back. And this is like my saying in like, in like, in like the way I think, I don't, I don't really ever take any L's in my life unless somebody dies. And the reason why I say this, cause Cause like if I so called take an L, if I learn from it, it's not an L, mm -hmm. because because it's help it's helping me to grow better right. as a right. as a man. So that's just how I look at everything. So if something bad happens, I don't take it as a L. I'm like, okay, I just learn from that, do better, and then I and do better. Yeah, do way better.
I'm keeping this shit on track right now. I don't take no Adderall. Girl, watch you make my feelings dissolve. Phone ring, I decline that call. What's trouble? I get back with y'all. I ain't gonna we'll top my eyes and fall. Through the rain, don't send through all this fall. Said a lot right there. So, one thing I see, um, as I sit here and think, and I think about all the um, young men that I've talked to, um, we don't want to be like our fathers, but sometimes we end up like our fathers mm -hmm. with multiple children. And then we, to neglect that, we might, material things don't buy happiness, don't buy really true love. So you can have all the material things that you want, but are you really still happy? Mm -hmm. You know, he has a lot, but it still does, he's, he's still broken. And he's on his way to healing. He might not realize it, but he's on his way to healing. But he's got to keep expressing himself. He's got, to, and then you come to some point that you gotta let it go. Yeah. You come to terms with it and you let it go. But don't make the same mistake. Yeah. With your children, don't make the same mistake. Don't abandon, if you got a boy, don't abandon him. And girls, girls need their fathers too. So don't make the same mistake. Can't trail, you got a man up, you done had all these keys I'm like, can't trail, you gotta stand up, it's your time, I see I'm like, he's trying, begging you to hustling back with nigga you didn't want I just felt they said that you not good for anyone Did you hear song. what he said? He's not good for anyone. Yeah. And the thing about it is, you you can't think that. You know, you got to raise those kids. You got to be involved in their life. Just giving them whatever, all the material things in the world. What kids need is your love, and they need your time. So that's that's, that's my last take on that. And yeah, that is my greatest reaction to. I got this. Whoa, I said I got this. That's crazy. That's the next video. If y'all wanted to know, that's the next video. But that's my greatest reaction to Hardy. So uh, I really hope I did enjoy this reaction video, man. Please don't forget to leave a like, comment. If you're new to this channel, go, into, go on and hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to be you, be great, and continue on following your dreams, man. And just keep pushing. I know it's tough. I know. Thank y'all. Love y'all. I'm out. Peace.